guys, I'm going to be doing, um, a, like, cool, not collaborative, um, um, like, I went to the thrift store, like, a bunch of times during the course of, like, a month, so I guess it might be called collaborative, or, like, so I'm doing, like, all of those times, like, combined, in combined into one, <laughs> one haul thing. <laughs> I'm not good at speaking. Um, yeah. So, um, uh, I'm gonna start with the books, because I got, like, the most books. And, like, most of these books, most of the books I got was from, uh, yesterday. Because there was this, this store I like to go to that was having a sale for, like, six paperback books for 99 cents altogether, like, as a group. <laughs> six books for 99 cents or they had like four hardcovers for 99 cents so that's like pretty good like that's like less than a quarter per book so I got like a lot of stuff and I'm just start with the pile from yesterday I got um I got a pocket dictionary because like I've been wanting a dictionary like a real dictionary like a book version of it and I got this little one. It's like a pocket book. So like, it's very small. It's like my hand size. Palm of my hand. And it says the vest pocket dictionary. And, and then I found these, which these are, as you can see, they used to be like library books. But this is a whole series. It's um, The Dark is Rising Sequence by Susan Cooper. Yeah, so, yeah, I got all five of the books, which is really weird to find, like, especially at thrift stores. Like, if you find all of a series, that's, like, super rare in one go. So, this is the first book, um, Over Sea Understone. And then this is right. The docks is rising. Um, Green Witch. The Grey King. I'm like trying to read these in like the screen, so like I'm reading them backwards. So it's like kind of hard. Silver on the tree. So yeah, I'm excited to read all these because these just looked really cool. The first one I saw, I saw this one first, and I thought. This cover just looked really cool with like branches and stuff, so yeah. And then I realized I got all of them, so yay. <laughs> and then I got, I found this book, The Help, which I saw this movie, and I love this movie. So I'm really excited to read the book, and hopefully, like, the book is as good as the movie, and like, maybe even better. They usually tend to be better. And then I got this book. A Wrinkle in Time by Madeline, I don't know how to pronounce the last name, but yeah. So I got this book, and I really like it, it has like one of those metal things, so yeah. And then I got this book, The Other Worldlies by Jennifer and Kohler? I don't know how to pronounce that. But yeah, this looked really cool. And then I got, found this book, which I have not read the first one, and the, but I saw the movie, and I really loved the movie, so I wanna, I've i been wanting these books, so I'm glad I got this while I saw it, and it's really pretty. I like the words, and the words are like raised. And this is the second book in the Beautiful Creatures storybooks thing and this is in really like good shape like look at that that's just beautiful like has a sticker on it though and then I got Bite Me by Melissa France or something I don't know Francis I don't know I just really love love vampire books I just noticed this is a Hopper teen book and I really like Hopper teen books usually too. 
because of the Vampire Diaries war, war from them. I read like almost the first, I read the first 50 pages online uh, on Hot 13 of the Vampire Diaries before I got them for my 16th birthday. So, like, they have like books online that you can read. And then I got this book, The Weird Sisters. This sounds really cool about like sisters, like, that love books and like stuff. And it's by Eleanor Brown. And then I got The Pretties. Or Pretties, I guess it's not the. But and I think this is a sequel. And I got the uglies not too long ago, like like a month or two ago. I still haven't read it yet though. But I so I'm like oh, a second book, yay, so I can find it. So yeah, and then I got second book of this is the second book of The People of Sparks, which I have not read this series, but like my brother read it and he really liked it. And I wanna get like the first book so I can read this series but like if you can find a book for super cheap even if it's like the second book and you don't have the first one I think it's really like worth it to get it and like yeah so like yeah these this is a pile of books I got from yesterday so yeah it's a pretty big pile well, except for the other Woodleys. That was from a different time. That was just on my bed, so. Then I got this, because this looked super cool. Like, look at that. Look at that cover. That's why I bought it. Because, <laughs> like, it's all, like, steampunky. It's Leviathan by Scott Westerly. Beald, Wa Westerfield, not Westerly. And, yeah. And then I bought got this book, The Amber Spyglass, which I found out is the third book, actually. I was thinking it was either the second or third when I bought it, because I already have the first one, and after I read the first one, I realized it was a trilogy, and I really wanted them, so I found this, but I just got the second book from Thrift Books. Like, I got a couple books from there, I'm going to do a review after this one, but yeah. So, The Amber Spyglass by Philip Pullman. And I got Briss and Girl by Christopher uh, P Paolini, which is the third book. And then I got this book, basically, because it looked really cool. And they had, like, ten of these. Like, when I went there, ten of this is that book. Like, in this is that cover. And I'm just like, whoa. But I really like the, the tree of this guy. But apparently this is a third book. So I need to get the other books before, like, I start reading this. So, yeah. But it's still cool. It looks cool. I mean, I mean it's really nice. Even though it's, like, hardcover. Because I prefer paperback. But hardcover is cool, too. So, yeah. Those are all the books I got. Then I got, I got this, like, nail art thing that I just... I just liked, I just liked it, and I wanted to, like, look cool, it was only, like, three dollars, so, and then I got yarn, which these are both grays, this, I really like this one a lot, and this I just got to, like, add to my collection, to, like, just in case if someone wants, like, a gray hat, like a plain gray hat, like, I can make it and not have to go out and buy it for, like, some money. And then, then I got, got two dresses. Are they both dresses? Yeah. So I'm the, I know if this has, like, lace on the top, and then it's, like, one of those big things, and it's like that. And then I got this sweater dress. which I'm holding upside down. And yeah, this is really cute. It has one of those like big collars though, which I wasn't sure about at first because it has a pocket too. Because I don't like like turtlenecks or anything like that. It feel they feel like they're choking me like but like yeah. 
And then I also got um I'm gonna try to show you this like on my dresser. Okay, I got two of these CD stands. I hope you can see this okay. But yeah, two of these, they both match. Um, because they were only two bucks. And here's a better version. But I look at it. They were like two bucks each. They both match. And then I also got, like, all these CDs, except for like four or five of them recently. <laughs> I mean, yeah, because that one thrift store that I was talking about that did the book sale, they also had a sale that had you get ten CDs for what for ninety nine cents too. So but it was two different days that the sales were going on. But yeah. And that's really a good deal and stuff. <sighs> I'm getting a little sick so I'm like a little bit coughing and her breath and stuff but yeah so I thought that was like a really really good deal and <coughs> <coughs> so I guess I, that's all I got so I guess I'm gonna like say bio <laughs> so bye guys I love you have a good day <laughs>